do you see more quarterbacks coming out? I know, and I know we're looking at these quarterbacks now. You can't really replicate Lamar Jackson. No. But no. this is a copycat league. You can't replicate Patrick Mahomes. You have a better chance replicating Patrick Mahomes than you do Lamar Jackson. So what is the future at that position or offenses in the NFL when it comes to quarterbacks? Well, I think it's that that model. It's a, it's going to be dual threat. Even Ryan Tannehill. Look at the four AFC quarterbacks, right? Patrick Mahomes can move and throw on the run. Ryan Tannehill. You got uh, um, you know Lamar Jackson. And, and so that's situ- Deshaun Watson. So that's the look in the AFC. Now, the NFC is still a little more drop back. Uh, you know, well, Rodgers still athletic. Russell Wilson, very athletic. Very athletic. Yeah. So I believe it's going in that direction. Is Garoppolo athletic? Well, I mean, one of the only times you've seen him run is when he tore his ACL stepping yeah. out of bounds, yeah. right? So, but if you look at Trevor Lawrence, he's athletic. Yeah. Justin Herbert, athletic. Yeah. Uh, Justin Fields, I don't know if he's considered athletic. He's really, I think he's really, really athletic. Joe Burrow, really athletic. Yeah. So. This is where we're moving to, and the collegiate scheme of what they're doing in offense, it's it's moving to the pro game, right? More RPOs, more run, um, zone read, letting the quarterback do some more things. So um, I suspect that's the where we're going to go at the quarterback position, and we have a few holdouts still hanging there, like you talked about. Aaron Rodgers is is athletic, yeah. but you know if he could stay in the pocket and just zip it around, that's that that's his bread and butter. But if I said Trevor Lawrence is available this year and Joe Burrow. Well, I'm a Trevor Lawrence fan. I, I drank the Kool-Aid of, uh, of Clemson long ago. So if he could if he would, could be drafted this year, I believe he'd be the first guy picked just because of his size, his strength. He has all the athletic ability. And but is he, he capable? And I know Burrow is a couple of years older than him. But is he capable of doing what Burrow did this year? I mean, he had arguably the greatest season a quarterback has ever had. Yes, he has. Efficiency-wise, he had. I, I just don't – I didn't see progression with Trevor Lawrence this year. I saw progression. I saw early on he was the face of college football, the Heisman Trophy uh, um, front runner, front runner and, and simply pressed too hard. And he had a great room of, of wide receivers, and he threw the ball up a little bit more than he probably should have. Okay. Luckily for them, Travis Etienne's on that team, and he took care of everybody for the first five games. But since that North Carolina game, the Louisville game as well, Trevor Lawrence has 22 touchdowns, zero interceptions, right? He, Are he, you picking Clemson? I am picking Clemson. Outright. Outright. Really? Yeah, they win, they win against the spread. I mean, if, oh, you, okay. if you're out there, people, and you like to, you know, venture for out entertainment the game. Pur- for, for entertainment, entertainment purposes, purposes yeah. you know, run, run with Clemson plus the, what is it, six and it's a half? Five seven and a half? Yeah. Five and a half? Yeah, run. Is that what it is, Paulie? Five and a half. Yeah, all right. Yeah, run away with that. Really? Yeah. Clemson wins outright. Clemson wins 48-38. Paulie, call my guy. On it. Or is it your guy? My guy. My guy's no longer living. I got a guy. I met him in prison. I'll, I'll give him a call for you. <laughs> for more Dan Patrick Show, tune in to Audience Channel 239 on DirecTV. Stream for free on BR Live or download the Dan Patrick Show app.